It was the day before Christmas, and all through the hills the reindeer were playing, enjoying the spills of skating, and coasting, and climbing the willows, and hopscotch, and leapfrog, protected by pillows. noses are brownish and tiny, Rudolph's was red, very large, and quite shiny. Rudolph! Go on home, red nose. Your mama's calling you. Come, come, Rudolph. Tonight, you hang up your stocking. His nose is a sight. It's red as a beet. Twice as big and twice as bright. While way, way up north on this dark, foggy night, awaiting the time for his Christmas Eve flight, good old Santa. Mmm, this fog will be hard to get through. Santa with gloom, 
while slowly he groped toward the next reindeer's room. The lamp wasn't burning. The glow came instead from Rudolph's red nose at the head of the bed. And then came the greatest idea in all history. So Rudolph is told of the dark and delay, the fog and the blackness and losing the way. I need you tonight to lead all my deer on the rest of our flight. Dear Mommy and Daddy, I have gone to help Santa. Don't worry, Rudolph, that's me. Hurry, Rudolph, it's very dark here. With Rudolph's red nose as a wonderful light, old Santa flew quickly the rest of the night. so fast that before it was day, the very last present was given away. Hear ye, hear ye, a message from Rudolph. Yes, they'd found Rudolph's message. It's all over town. Hear ye, hear ye, Rudolph at the stadium. Come on, come on. Deer who used to do nothing but tease him? Well, now they'd do anything only to please him. Rudolph, my boy, they'll envy you now far and near, for no greater honor can come to a deer than riding with Santa and guiding my sleigh. The number one job on the number one day. I hope you'll continue to keep us from grief. I hereby appoint you Commander-in-Chief. And Rudolph just blushed from his head to his toes until his whole fur was as red as his nose. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night.